I'll finish. Sorry, I'm good. I'm gonna finish. <laughs> I'm gonna finish. That's a sweeping van. Pick people up. We don't quit. That's right. We don't quit. Here's a hole. Here's a hole in the fence. <laughs> Do it quick. Tasty, tasty. Not just the plate of eggs, but the races. Just a reminder, I'm sure you do this as well, but remind yourself, man, racing is fun. Keep dreaming and keep working. All right, so you probably do this on Strava, on Instagram. Oh, I just like to do, I just like to do it on the vlog. So that's what the, that was uh, New York City and then Rotterdam, all right? My last two marathons, actually, now that I, now that I think of it. Boston Marathon coming up in April. Uh, group run is going to be Sunday morning. Date, sorry, time and location is yet to be determined, okay? It's, but it's going to be Sunday morning, probably between 8 a.m. and 10 a.m. Just, you know, keep that in your mind. I will announce officially once. I just need to do a little more recon and talk to some people in the greater Boston, Mar the greater Boston area. Also, Monday, after the marathon, again, location to be determined, dinner that night. After the Boston Marathon, somewhere, some that's going to be tough, uh, a little bit, probably even tougher to coordinate. But anyway, after the marathon, somewhere, a meetup for dinner in Boston. Okay, here we go. New York City. Next week, I did a Twitter poll and Facebook yesterday asking when is the best time. I'm going to New York City next week. Uh, when is the best time to do a group run and the winner was morning, which makes sense. You know, people like to run in the morning. So... Wednesday, here it is on your screen right now. Wednesday, March 15th, 7.15 a.m. I will arrive, 7.30, we'll start running. Because I realize, I know, and listen, time is, like, no time is perfect, okay? Some people, that's late. Some people, that's too early. But it's just, you know, that's just the way it is, all right? So as far as trying to accommodate everybody's, but 77, 72nd Street, and Central Park West will plan to do, okay, and you can peel off whenever you need to, one loop around the park, which is basically, it is six miles, okay? So there you go. That's next week's group run, but here we go. The same day, Wednesday, March 15th, 6.30 p.m. at the Hoka Store in Flatiron, okay? There's the address on your screen. It's, it's a, I don't even know how to describe it. I'm running a Unaf it's a race. Race the Bridges is putting it on. Um, I believe is the company or the organization. 
I believe it's right about four miles and it's not a marked course. I don't know all the details, but I will be there at 6.30 p.m. at the Hoka store that day, uh, that Wednesday, March 15th for this event. I'm just going to call it, it's not, a, it's a race, but it's, all, and you have to buy tickets if you want to do the race, okay? I don't know how it's going to go down. I was just told this is happening, so I signed up and I'll be there. I think it's about a four mile race through the streets of New York City. That's, I'm just gonna leave it there. Whew, that was a lot. Okay, registered for two races. Question of the day, what marathons have you registered for in the next 365 days? Name them, all right, why did you choose them? All right, down below, could be road, could be trail, all right? Any marathons on your calendar in the next 365 days? And Mandy, you get the comment of the day. My favorite birthday memory, is yet to come. I'll be celebrating my 40th birthday at the New York City 5K and Marathon this year. Mandy, that's amazing. Uh, beyond excited, hope everyone has a great day. Mandy, um, you get the comment of the day. Email me, Mandy, and I will um, send you a sticker. Sound good? Okay, two marathons registered for New York City Marathon. New York, Ro I don't know what's going on. New York Road Runners just keeps I don't even know what's going on. Bottom line, I registered, but I wanna put a big, big asterisk and caveat. Um, it is not gonna be my A race in the fall, okay? The New York City Marathon. And with family and life and sports with the kids, I cannot even guarantee that I will be there. But I did register because New York Road Runners, I don't even, I think it was my time from 2020 where I ran, I think, 224. They, uh, I think I get a, I don't even know, like a free entry. I'm not sure. They don't really make it clear on the website, but I am registered and I might turn it into a long run, maybe a half marathon workout, maybe just show up and uh, do a group run and then uh, cheer all of you on like Mandy um, in the 2023 New York City Marathon. All right, there you go. And then of course, drum roll for number two. Back to Sacramento. You better believe it. CIM, December 3rd. Registered? Rock and roll? You gonna be there? CIM, December 3rd. Um, yeah, well, I don't know. What is it? Seven or eight months away? I'm not even sure. But there you have it. All right, New York, CIM, registered, rock and roll time. And, uh, and we're already, DDGR is already plotting for some racing in early 2024, which is, I'm not registered for those yet, but. It's, uh, it's on the radar. Onward we go. We'll, of course, toss it to the New York City Marathon right there. Uh, I'll probably, you know what, I'll do the 2020 version. In case you've already seen, uh, a lot of people have already seen the most recent one. But the old, old one right there. All right, have a great day. Have a great week of running. We will see you next week in New York City. All right, seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.